Hey, trendies and trendsetters. Okay, y'all. I know we kind of talked about this before, but I don't think I put it in my in a separate video. So we're gonna talk about it more uh, in depth. Stormy, <laughs> Stormy is hinting that she's coming out with a seasoning line, y'all. I think it was lumped together in the same post about trying to teach other entrepreneurs how to scale. Y'all, she's trying to make a seasoning, okay? Um, a line. I think it's something to sell, not just because it's like something she's going to do at home, okay? Now, I know I could be reading into this, but Stormy made what looks like is a roast, right? And you know, Melody had one on her live yesterday and said, I'm finishing up my roast. And then Stormy talking about, put, put this on last night at 8 p.m. Wanted to make something quick and easy. It's my first one ever, but it's the best. And it looks like a, a roast to me, like a pot roast, right? I see the... Is either pepper and sinis or banana peppers that were in there, right? So I'm like, okay, okay. I know plenty of plenty of women make roasts, so let me just let it go. But then when her next story came up, and it said, my cousin said you seasoned the hell out of it, lol. I can't wait to till I get free enough to cook every day. It's really a little passion of mine. Now, Stormy, I don't know when you're supposed to find this free time because you're supposed to be out there packing these orders that people are still waiting on from your hair care products and now your body glaze. You got a lot of uh, back orders you're supposed to be working on. So I don't know where you're going to find the time either to make this seasoning. But OK, it says I went from experimenting in the kitchen, finding my own way, even when it made no sense, LOL, to doing something for the first and it being the best. I, I get it. Kind of okay, she experimented. We'll just say that because the sentence went weird for me. Um, then the last part says, and I love making my own seasoning. I'm telling y'all, she's trying to timestamp this so you so we can't say she copied Melody <laughs> on making a seasoning too. Well, I'm not saying she won't ever make a seasoning, but I will say this I'm questioning what percentage of customers will actually get that seasoning to taste it and who is still out here trusting enough to buy her online orders of seasoning because you know she's gonna put it out online to us and then maybe try to get it in stores y'all if you're gonna try it wait till it can get in the stores otherwise just uh i mean at this point just flushing money down the toilet if you're just gonna be ordering online because allegedly people are not getting their orders and i'm saying um i'm saying that but y'all on the better business bureau there are still unanswered complaints about people not getting their products or getting partial orders, et cetera. So at your own risk, but I don't even know why you want it. I don't, at this point, I don't understand. Stormy, please just go pack those people's orders. Like their hair care products they're waiting on. Every sale you keep having and extending, these people aren't getting their orders, but then you're saying we also can't give you a refund because it was a sale. You do know, right? That means that the person actually has to get their product and then they maybe can't get a refund because they're not satisfied with the product. But if no product arrives, I don't think you're supposed to be saying we can't give you a refund. So just copy paste this scenario, guys. You're not going to get your seasoning, allegedly, and in my opinion. Um, so let's, you know, Stormy, I encourage you. And I'm dead serious when I say this. Let me just take the joking out of my voice. Hire more employees get straight with your back orders on the products you have already come out with try to get your debts in order so where you're not being embarrassed publicly all the time on record please scale back don't scale up scale back for your own sake it just looks crazy out here i'm i'm nosy so i'm gonna watch and see what the seasoning is i will not get it i but i will be watching i i like to observe this type of thing this type of human behavior is so fascinating to me like the amount of i'm guessing denial um possibly delusion it takes to keep pushing past the reality that we all see to I guess she's still trying to do a rebrand. Is it going to be canvas seasoning? I don't know. Um, <laughs> but wow, like how do you keep pushing past this to put out these new products and then you're going to go teach that class and um, all these things, but you can't find the time to go help the team, the skeleton team, in my opinion, that you do have to pack those orders or just refund those people their money in my opinion, I don't know if the funds are there for her to even give a refund. So at least give them their product. They probably don't, they don't, a lot of them say they don't want it at this point, but it's, it's uh, better than them having zero. 
and also shout out to succeeding uh, succeeding i hope you hear this video as she said y'all please if you didn't receive a product go get your money back through your bank and your card company don't wait on a company like this that is basically stating they're not giving you a refund because it was a sale get your money back the other legal ways um if this has happened to you this is crazy though so we might see some stormy seasoning coming soon y'all all right talk to you later bye